Aaron, Jimmy Cross has been found. If you know the situation, if you remember, you know the situation of Jimmy Cross. He talked about an Amber Alert was found on October 15, 2018, in the morning. <coughs> that she was sleeping, and her and her parents were sleeping at her their house in Bear, Wisconsin. And it was between 12 and 1 morning on Monday, October 15, 2018. Everyone was sleeping, and her parents. And then the guy just went crazy and killed everyone. Killed her mom and her dad. We do not know if there's any other family members, but they do not say if they had to kill the dog or anything like that. If they had any pets. But they didn't kill the parents. And they and Jamie did end up surviving. And they took, and the guy took. He is a twenty-one-year-old suspect. They are not mentioning his name to out to anyone, really. And there's a press conference at I don't know, do at ten a.m. local time. That's ten a.m. Central time. They're gonna be doing up in that area. About her, a live press conference. They are about her outside, outside, or indoors, maybe depends. But they are gonna be doing a press conference about her. Um, the suspect was two years old, and they have no is no relation to the family. No one knows her, so we do not know what's going on with that. Um, we have heard that Jamie Koss did end up, like, surviving, and she went, she was free from the man, and, and she was free, and she saw this woman walking on the side of the road, and she asked, with her dog, she had her cell phone in her pocket, and she was walking, and she asked her, he called 911 about us, and, the person's name who called 911 is not released to public. Jamie Koss is in Duluth, Minnesota, as a as a level one trauma center in urgent care, and they're working on her ASAP. Superior, Minnesota. There's a hospital, but is not an urgent care trauma center, so they are sending her there. To do they did, and the immediate family has not seen her. Her aunts, uncles, cousins, grandparents have not seen Jamie Claus at all yet. However, Jamie Claus will be seen by family at the uh, at um at the aunt's sisters. So one of her aunts' house. Everyone's gonna see her there. When she is released from the hospital, they're going to take her down to there, and stuff, so, mm -hmm. but yeah, and it's pretty much all we know about her, that she was found in Gordon, Wisconsin, some girl, she ran across, she's running to the side of the road. Where some girl was walking, some woman was walking her dog, and she called 911 on her cell phone. And I said, Hey, Jamie Koss is here. I found her. And they stayed put, she stayed put where she was, and the police ended up finding her. And everyone, and the ambulance, and stuff, and everyone took, took her. Police took her. The ambulance took her to her house. And they didn't do, do an interview with the aunt on Fox as well. And they said that. She was sad, obviously. And you can tell she was pretty sad. She had her emotions on there. It was just pretty, pretty sad. It was just heartbreaking for the family. 
if she was dead, if she was having a dead, but just be sad and and all happy emotions and just sad, happy, mixed feelings, emotion at the same time. You know, just sad, be happy, and it's just, you know, like it's just hard to describe. But, and then they had Patty Webb and like Jake Sorn and his mom, and she was there. Talking about on the phone about missing Serge, and she was just happy too for him, for all of us the kids. And I agree with her; she's happy. And in respect of Jamie Cross and her family, I will not be monetizing this video or any future videos about Jamie Cross. I will not be monetizing this at any time. The only way I will be is if I have to, and then I am going to upload it, and then I'm. Monetizing it after the video is uploaded. I will be unmonetizing ASAP. So I might get very few, it might get two views. Monetize, but other than that, I will not be monetizing. I respect for Jimmy Claus. Since Jimmy Claus has been found, and, and it was found at 443. Or 4.53 in the afternoon, excuse me. 4.53 in the afternoon. On Thursday, January 10th, 2018. She's found. And then they made a press re report. Or press release online. At 8, around 8 p.m. local time. On Thursday. For her. And yeah, she was. They... And that's pretty much it. And then it, Paul Bloom and Courtney Godfrey, um, talk about going up there, get reactions from her friends, and family. But obviously they stay soon. And they also she went to Duluth for treatment, but they do not. But they called Duluth Hospital. Courtney Godfrey did in Pakistan, and they said as it, they want to keep her anonymous. So. Receptionist at the counter, the check-in person at the counter, receptionist, whatever you want to call, did not say yes. Did not talk about it. Obviously, for the safety of her and her family. Mm -hmm. And I mean, I respect that. I respect that. See, so, yeah. then they're gonna have a bunch of new information that the family is gonna know. Everyone's pretty much gonna know. Lost information at 10 a.m. local time. It's 10 a.m. central time. Friday, January 2018. About Jimmy Claus. So, yeah. Lost information. It's going to be known about her. Yep. Then, so. The priest said temper her, her and her family. But she's. But the, the family's happy that she's in. Jimmy Claus is happy that she can be reunited with her family. Now, obviously. She's probably not going to go back to school. But she's going to be remaining at her school. Eventually when the time is right. When the time is right with her friends. And stuff. And her teachers and family. Is a immediate priority. And her friends and teachers at school are going to be seeing her. She's going to be put back in her normal math class. Her normal class with her friends. And just on a sad day, tragic day with her, and stuff like that. So, yeah, and I'll let you know more about the press conference. They had one more thing I remember in this video Jamie Claus was found, but they had a post on social media on Facebook from. Want a local sheriff's office page on Facebook, but they thought it was fake. Every people did. People started questioning if I was fake, and they let it go. They and they deleted it, and then they made an official press release about it. And ever and the sheriff's office, everyone can confirm, is official. Is official, so 
is not fake. It has been confirmed. And pretty much, yeah. Family, as you know, is really emotional. Just be thinking about it. Sand sucks in it. Take care. Keep your hurts and your family is going to be, be better off. In the future. So yeah. Take care of her. That's a pretty sad time. For her and her family. You know what I mean? And um and if you have any videos monetized about Jimmy Claus, please just do me a solid and just please demonetize him because of spirit of her heart because honestly, something some news like this should not be something to be profit of. Like I mean, I like it making a couple Watching it on YouTube, but please, as far as I like making videos, but I also like just making a little bit of money. Why not? I can make money back for making new videos, but this video, sad time trauma video, should not be when it ties off, should not be because of a spirit of heart and all the sad tragedy. It should just be feeling love and emotion, love for her. Support her the best that we can. I mean, trying to profit off her in time of sorrow. And Alexa, took care of her.